Hello, Facebook. How are you today? Hey, it's me, Charlie. You all remember me, Charlie. Charlie and Nix. That's Mix right there with the mask on. That's Mix, yeah. Hey, what's going on, Facebook? Ain't seen you in a while. Uh, Nix, uh, he's been keeping me in. I don't know why. He keeps me around the house. Yeah, yeah, Charlie, yeah. How y'all doing today? Hope everything's well. Hey, it's icy outside, so make sure you uh, drive slow and obey all traffic laws. All right? Because you'll be slipping and sliding, teeping and hiding. <laughs> I heard Nixon say that. Yeah, slipping and sliding. We don't want you to slide into nobody. You know what I mean? Yeah, because uh, when I'm driving, I'm always looking where I'm going. Not like somebody else I know. <laughs> hey, Charlie, that ain't nice. Well, Nixon, sometimes you be lunching. You, you have a lot on your mind. You know, you're thinking about Josie and stuff and stuff like that. Yeah, I guess you're right, Charlie. Well, how are you doing? Uh, I'm doing pretty good, Nixon. Uh, I'm all right. I feel good. I'm, I'm up early in the morning. and uh, Oh, uh, you still doing a Bible study in the morning? Yeah, Charlie, I'm still doing it. Well, how are you making out? Making out pretty good, Charlie. Uh, is anybody watching on Facebook in the morning? Yeah, Charlie, got people listening in the morning on Facebook. And the team, they always uh, listen. Well, uh, who's all on the team? Well, you got Robert L. Boston's on the team. And uh, Sister Pickens. Uh, who else? Um, Sister Catherine. Okay, yeah, I know her, and uh, who else? Don't get me to start calling names. Nan and Bruce Cheatham. Oh, okay, yeah, I, I know them. And a lot of people, a lot of new people are listening in. Oh, okay, all right. Well, that's, uh, that's a good thing. Because we need Bible study, we need prayer, because we're like in the last days. Right, Nixon? You're right, Charlie, we're in the last days. Uh, but Nixon, I, I need to ask you a question. What, Charlie? This COVID-19, uh, you, did, did you get your needle? Charlie, I haven't. Yeah, I haven't gotten it yet. Um, uh, well, mix it. I, I want to know if I should get it. Because there's a lot of stuff on about the news, and uh, I, I'm just undecided. Well, Charlie, I feel kind of the same way, but I guess eventually... We may all have to get it, but I'm not in no rush. Uh, I, I feel the same way, Mixon. I, I, I'm not in no rush. I feel good. My temperature is good. My stomach's good. My heart's good. You know, I, I kind of think I'm awake too. Yeah, yeah, I think I'm awake. Oh, good. See what see what happens. You know. Uh, yeah, Mixon. I think that's a good idea. Uh, but Charlie, maybe you ought to get it first. What? I ought to get it first. Maybe you ought to get it first. You're always pushing me out to do something. <laughs> Tell them about me. Did y'all hear what Nixon said? He said, me, I ought to get the COVID-19 shot first so he can see how it goes. <laughs> I know that trick. Put me, I'm the guinea pig, right? No, Charlie, you're not the guinea pig, but you like, you know, you cutting edge. You like to do things first. Uh, yeah, Mixon. I like to eat first. <laughs> that's about it. I want to eat first. That's it. But I don't know about taking that COVID first. Uh, I, I, I like you to go first, Mix. Well, listen, Charlie. I am. Um, I think I'm gonna. I'm gonna. Everybody else is gonna. I guess eventually have to take it. And I'll take it. I guess when it's the right time. Uh, yeah, Mixon. Uh, but don't be. Don't be pushing me down into the clinic to take the COVID-19 test and, unless you take it first. Because, Nixon, I'm going to see how it works in your body. And if you're still around, then, then I'll probably go down. And, and I'll let them give me a shot. Uh, right here in your arm. Right here. Okay. I heard that. I heard that. Because uh, I don't like to be running out for stuff. Uh, and I don't know all about it. I hear what they say on the news. But I'm just a little unsure right now. Uh, you know, I got to pray about it. Charlie, that's a good idea to pray about it. 
And, and next thing you need to pray about it too. Charlie, that's a good idea. Uh, do you know anybody that took it already? Yeah, one of my members, one of our good members, uh, took took the COVID already. Uh, how they doing? Well, so far, they, they doing pretty good. Uh, okay, that's a good sign. Uh, anybody else you know Nixon took it? Uh, I think Pastor Nelson might have took it. Oh, Pastor Nelson? Yeah, Pastor Nelson. Oh, yeah, okay. I know. I remember. She just sit right over there. Remember? She just said she talked to me a couple times too, Nixon. She she's very intelligent, uh, very articulate too. Yep, that's Pastor Nelson. Yeah, yeah. She is she coming back? Yeah, she's coming back. She's under the weather. When she gets well, she'll be back with us. Oh yeah, because she she's a real nice lady. I like her a lot. So you said uh, she's got the she she, she took the, the needle too. I think so, Charlie. I think so. A lot of people are taking it. They're lining up. Well, uh, Mixon, I'm going to wait for you. Uh, I'm going to see uh, how it works with you, and then uh, if it goes well with you, then, then, I'll, then I'll, I'll do it. Okay? Okay, and it's your choice, Charlie. It's your choice. We have to have our own mind about things, right? Yeah, that's right, Mixon. you got to have your own mind. You know what I mean? You can't let other people run your mind, you know? Uh, like you used to. <laughs> uh, how how is Josie being? Josie's doing good. Uh, is she getting better? Yes, yes she is. She's getting better, Charlie. Thank you for asking. Uh, how is Mabel? Well, Nixon, Mabel is Mabel. Is Mabel going to take the COVID shot? Well, yeah. She's. We've been talking about it, and she said she's going to take it. So uh, I got it. I gotta take her down to the clinic to get it. Uh, okay. Well, you gonna let her take it before you? Uh, yeah, Mixer. Uh, you take. You gonna let Josie take it before you? <laughs> well, yeah. Well, that's different. You know, you and Mabel, y'all are progressive. I figured, you know, y'all like right out there, you up front. Uh, yeah, Mixer. But uh, on that day, I'm gonna be in the back. <laughs> I want to see how this thing going to work out when I start putting something in my arm. You know what I'm saying? I ain't trying to be smart, but uh, last time I spent a dollar, it said, in God, we trust. <laughs> yeah, that's true. That's true. We're going to trust the boy. Yeah, Mason, we're going we're gonna to trust the boy. But what you want to tell the audience today? Well, I want to tell everybody to be safe and love your neighbor. Love your neighbor as yourself. And, and, and watch out for people. we got to watch out for each other. We, we don't need to fight each other. There's enough going on in the world for us fighting against one another. You know what I mean? Uh, do the right thing. Uh, love your family, your neighbors, and your friends, too. And, and try to treat people with respect. You know, be nice, be, be nice to people. Right, Nixon? That a good thing? Charlie, that's an excellent thing. Uh, Carol was teaching the other day. She said, uh, put away wrath and anger. In other words, don't be busting nobody upside the head. <laughs> that's right. That's right. That's right. Uh, love your neighbor uh, as yourself. In other words, whatever you do to others, you know, do it uh, anticipating somebody doing the same thing to you. So make sure you're doing the right thing. And uh, when it's your turn, get the covert, you use your own mind. You know, your conscience, let your conscience be your God. If you take it in the name of the Lord, uh, that's faith. If you don't take it in the name of the Lord, that's faith too. You know what, Nixon? What? That reminds me of what you were saying about the Apostle Paul in the book of Romans. When the people was eating pork, some people were offended by it. Christian people. And Paul said, listen, don't do anything to make your brother stumble. Because one guy, he's not eating pork and honoring God, right? That's right. And the other guy, he's eating pork. He's saying, mm, mm, good. Thank you, Jesus. So both of them are really honoring God. One is honoring God. 
by not eating it, and the other is honoring God by eating it. So neither one of them are wrong, both of them are right, because they're honoring God. It's the same thing with COVID. What do you mean, Charlie? Well, uh, one guy says, I want to honor God by not taking it, because I'm going to trust the Lord. And then another person says, I'm not going to take it. No, I am going to take it, uh, because I'm trusting the Lord. So both of them are trusting the Lord, which makes neither one of them wrong. You get it? Boy, that kind of makes sense, Charlie. Uh, both of them are honoring God. The God is not taking it. He's doing it to honor God. And the one is taking it. He's doing it to honor God. So it's like the pork sandwich. They're both doing it or not doing it to honor the Lord. Charlie, that makes a lot of sense. Charlie, you, you're pretty smart. You know that? Uh, yeah, I, I learned some stuff from you. Yeah, I'll be listening to that Bible study you have in the morning. <laughs> Sometimes you think I'm asleep, Nixon, but I'll be listening. Oh, well, that's 